hey guys welcome and welcome back to my youtube channel thank you so so much for tuning in today guys i appreciate it okay so guys today in this video i'm going to be sharing with you guys how to prepare a hair strat a hair tea yeah from neem leaves and aloe vera and i like using this before conditioning my hair like right after shampooing my hair okay why i do this is because if i apply it on my hair before shampooing my hair I am going to wash it out with the shampoo and I would like this to work perfectly on my hair before I wash it out okay so that is why I prefer washing it I prefer using it on my hair right before conditioning my hair and right after shampooing my hair okay so you guys let's just get straight into today's video and please if you haven't subscribed to my channel please just go ahead and hit that subscribe button it doesn't really cost a thing just hit on you subscribe to my channel and turn the notification bell on so you'll be notified each time I upload a new video okay so as you guys can see, I'm just trying to remove the leaves from the stem or from the sticks because I don't need them, okay? So you can actually get this in a herbal shop or in your neighborhood. I think this is very popular, like the leaves are very popular. So you can actually get it around you, okay? Neem is also known as Indian lilac and it is used extensively in Ayurvedic medicine. It is highly beneficial to the body, skin and hair especially. Neem is one of the best types of herbs, like when I say best, I mean best types of herbs that encourage hair development. It has um, anti antibacterial, antiseptic, antimicrobial and anti-inflammatory properties. Okay, so neem juice, the juice we are going to be preparing today can also be extracted from the seeds. But for today's recipe, I'm going to be using just the leaves, okay, and then the aloe vera. And as you guys can see, I'm just trying to remove the um the scale from the aloe vera the both sides and then i'm just going to cut it into smaller pieces and then i'll wash it very very well just to remove the yellow latex because it is going to itch your your hair your skin and your scalp if it gets in contact with you so make sure you remove you wash the um aloe vera very very well just to make sure that you've removed the um yellow latex from it okay Neem leaves also have high fatty acid content and are used to cure scalp issues. It also helps to condition your scalp greatly from the root to the tip of your hair. Any form of ne um, neem extract, be it water, oil, penetrates into the roots of the hair follicles and improves density of your hair. Neem also removes debris, excess oil and dead cells from the hair and scalp. It reduces um, scalp inflammation. I already said that it has anti-inflammatory properties. So it's going to remove your inflammation if you have it already. And it's also going to prevent it if you don't have it. Okay. Neem also strengthens and protects hair from damage. It cures dandruff. Okay. So if you're looking for a natural treatment for dandruff, try this recipe. It is definitely going to work for you. It is a promise. Okay. It's also a very good treatment for lice. If you have lice on your hair, then you should definitely try this recipe as well. So as you guys can see, I'm just trying to cut cut the aloe vera into small um bits after washing it very well i just went on ahead to cut it into small bits and then i also went on ahead to wash the um neem leaves as well and then i just transferred everything into my blender so guys for the blending i actually added just a little bit of water a little bit of water okay so because i am using aloe vera in this extract in this um recipe you can use it as a detangler you guys already know that um aloe vera is a very good detangling agent a very good detangling ingredient okay for your hair so you can use it as a detangler and as a moisturizer as well so i just went on ahead to blend it into a very smooth paste as you guys can see it is very very smooth right now so the next step was um extracting my juice as you guys can see what i am doing right now i'm just using my sieve to extract every of my juice okay you can also use a cheese cloth or a muslin cloth so after extracting the juice i just went on ahead to stir it and then i added just a tablespoon sorry a teaspoon just a teaspoon of my carrier oil you can use any carrier oil of your choice okay and then i stirred everything together to mix it and then i went on ahead to transfer it into my spray bottle as you guys can see and yeah it is ready for use so because neem is equally good for the skin you can also go ahead to spray this all over your skin and then just rub it or more like 
massage it yeah but then we have a reason for preparing this so let's just get to it so you guys i just finished shampooing my hair if you guys can notice it if you guys can see it there's still some water on water content on my hair i just did that like 10 minutes ago you guys i've been on this bed for like two weeks now and i am like i'm enjoying it because it actually helps me to do a lot of things without having to bother about my hair so but though it's already old but yeah i'm going to lose that very soon okay so i just went on ahead to start spraying the um the extract the tea the juice on my hair as you guys can see and i'm going to be massaging my hair my scalp as well which is the very the most important thing so you guys can see that i am trying to concentrate on my hairline my front hair that's my um my problem my issue so i always like to concentrate on it much more than every other part of my hair because i have an issue there and i want to treat it okay boy you guys if you're if you're not on braids or if you're not on twist just the way my hair is please just part your hair into small sections detangle it first with your hand and then spray the um the content the extracts on that particular section and then you detangle again with your hand and run through run your hand through the hair section before you put it in a protective hairstyle I think I already said this, but I'm just going to repeat it again. Please make sure you are using this on your hair after shampooing your hair. If you use it before you shampoo your hair, you're going to lose it because um, the shampoo is going to wash it off without it working. So after shampooing your hair, you can just go ahead to spray this on your hair. So this extract is also a good recipe for people that have frizzy hair issues because neem has fatty acids which helps the hair follicles in a moist condition okay so if you have frizzy hair then you should also try this recipe aloe vera also has properties of b12 and folic acid which can help in preventing hair loss and hair thinning so the aloe vera we used um in this recipe contains vitamins a c and e which contributes to cell turnover thereby promoting cell growth and shiny hair okay um aloe vera is it is good for healthy hair like it is good for healthier scalp and hair it is also great for um treating dandruff aloe vera helps to stimulate hair growth it also adds moisture to your hair and not just your hair but also your scalp i think i already said that aloe vera helps with um, moisturizing your hair conditioning your hair okay so after spraying the contents all over my hair and equally massaging my scalp my hair every part of my hair very very well especially my hairline i just went on ahead to you know use my plastic bag my shower cap to cover my hair and then i'm going to allow this to sit in my hair i'm going to allow this to sit in my hair depending on how busy i get it might be 30 minutes before conditioning my hair or um 20 minutes 10 minutes depending on how busy i get over time okay so guys that's basically all for today's video so if this video was really helpful to you please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and again if you haven't subscribed to my channel please go ahead and hit that, that subscribe button subscribe to my channel like this video comment share all the good stuff okay thank you guys for watching i love you and i'll see you in my next one bye